Naval Sketchbook, The Service Afloat and Ashore, with Characteristic Reminiscences Fragments and Opinions, Volume 1, by William Nugent Glasscock offers a captivating glimpse into the maritime world of the 19th century. Through a collection of sketches, reminiscences, and opinions, Glasscock paints a vivid picture of life both at sea and on land, providing readers with a multifaceted exploration of naval service. Glasscock's work is characterized by its authenticity and depth, drawing from his own experiences as a naval officer. The sketches presented in the book offer intricate details of naval operations, portraying the challenges and triumphs faced by sailors navigating the unpredictable waters of the sea. Through his descriptive prose, Glasscock immerses the reader in the sights, sounds, and sensations of life aboard a naval vessel, capturing the essence of the maritime environment with precision and nuance. One of the notable aspects of Naval Sketchbook is Glasscock's ability to interweave personal anecdotes with broader reflections on naval culture and tradition. Through his reminiscences, he provides insights into the camaraderie and camaraderie that define life in the Navy, as well as the bonds forged through shared experiences and hardships. These anecdotes not only add depth to the narrative but also humanize the sailors whose stories are being told, offering readers a glimpse into the individual lives behind the uniform. In addition to his first-hand accounts, Glasscock also offers a series of opinions and reflections on various aspects of naval service. From discussions on tactics and strategy to musings on leadership and discipline, his insights are thought-provoking and often reveal a keen understanding of the complexities of naval warfare. Through these opinions, Glasscock invites readers to engage with broader questions about the nature of naval power and the role of the sailor in shaping history. Throughout Naval Sketchbook, Glasscock demonstrates a deep appreciation for the sea and its significance in shaping the course of human events. His descriptions of naval battles are filled with a sense of drama and excitement, conveying the adrenaline-fueled intensity of combat at sea. Yet, amidst the chaos of battle, Glasscock also finds moments of beauty and tranquility, highlighting the profound connection that sailors often feel with the vast expanse of the ocean. In terms of style, Glasscock's prose is marked by its clarity and eloquence. His writing is accessible yet richly evocative, drawing readers into the world he so vividly describes. Whether recounting a thrilling naval engagement or reflecting on the quieter moments of life at sea, Glasscock's narrative voice is engaging and immersive, holding the reader's attention from start to finish. Overall, Naval Sketchbook, The Service Afloat and Ashore, with Characteristic Reminiscences Fragments and Opinions, Volume 1, is a compelling exploration of naval life in the 19th century. Through a combination of first-hand accounts, reflections, and opinions, William Nugent Glasscock offers readers a multifaceted portrait of life aboard a naval vessel, capturing both the excitement and the challenges of serving at sea. Rich in detail and insight, this volume is sure to fascinate anyone with an interest in maritime history or naval affairs.